Hey everybody, welcome back to my playthrough of Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Thank you so much for joining me again. As you can see, we've got ourselves another loading screen. This one is called Flowers But No Funeral. In 2025, Garm had been an Alpine geological research facility. Now, Jensen believed it might be harboring terrorists. He convinced Miller to send him and Chicane on a recon mission to find out, but somehow the terrorists learned he was coming. That is a bit suspicious, isn't it? How did they know he was coming? And Alex keeps saying that she doesn't really trust Miller yet. I don't know. Gold-masked shadow operatives watched in curiosity as Victor Marchenko injected him with the orchid and left him to die. Except Jensen didn't die. Escaping the base several hours later and reconnecting with Chicane, he raced back to Prague, positive that another attack was coming. Um, so if you watch the last couple of episodes, when we traveled to the Garm facility, uh, uh, initially I was going to try to be as uh, stealthful as possible. I, would, I was going to try to be a ghost because Miller wanted us to get in and just do recon, right? And so I thought, okay, well, I'll do that. Well, then Marchenko, you know, knew we were coming and our cover was blown or whatever. And so he killed us and then he thought that we were dead and so then I totally changed my approach. I was like, well the hell with these people. I'm going in and I'm gonna, you know, put them all to sleep and just do exploring. Uh, that was probably dumb because now they know that Jensen's still alive. They know that. However, if I didn't knock everybody out, there's no way in the world I would have would have been able to read all the terminals and pocket secretaries that we read and we wouldn't have learned as much as we learned. So I'm glad I did it. It was just a thought I had. Let us continue on. We're here in the Limb Clinic, and uh, as you can see, the world is a restricted zone now. So we need to figure out how to get from here, where we are now, over to here, Prahadovos. That's what we need to do. We need to figure out how to do that. Um, I remember that uh, the Limb Clinic had some vents up above. And there is a way to get out of here, but uh, there are also these stupid drones that uh, may very well see us. Up here anyway, you know? I mean, I was thinking, oh good, I'll just... What the? What the? What? SOS, 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 Samizdat, Sewers, Prokotska, Coordinates Uplated updated please help whoa oh no I received a strange beeping message from the alternate media group Samizdat the message included uploaded coordinates to an underground location in the Prokotska district great <laughs> that's just freaking great man oh this is over here back uh, behind Adam's apartment well how the heck am I gonna get to the subway right yeesh okay these guys need help Let's go help them. Uh, we are currently here, and the subway is right over here. Um, so we didn't have too much trouble getting here before, but the game got us here, right? If you saw the end of the last episode, you saw that when we left the station, the game just basically put us here. There's the subway there. I do not know how in the world we're going to get to it. Um, I mean, I know that there... There's a back way into the subway from the Libius apartments. So if I can get into these apartments, we should be able to get into the subway. At least I think there's a back way. But getting into those apartments may be just as difficult as getting into the subway itself. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, somebody was looking this way. And now they are suspicious. And now they are hostile. Wow. They are not messing around. They're not wasting any time. Huh. That's some kick-ass music there. Yeah, jamming. I think I got my speakers turned up too loud. Hostile. They are actively hostile. So this actually makes things more difficult because they often kind of just like instantly know where we are. Right? I mean, 
I'm hoping that's not the case this time. And they'll just eventually give up. This music's awesome. I like it. Boy, they sure did get hostile quick. Uh, problem is, they're just staying hostile. Uh, whoa, they are right outside the door there, I guess. So much for jumping back up here. Threat lost. Okay, you guys need to give up because I don't want to just kind of hang out here forever. There is a basement to this place, but it doesn't go anywhere. So there's really no reason to go down in the basement, but we're going to go down in it anyway. Just to see if anything has changed down here. Or something down here that I forgot before. Martial law declared. Lawmakers in Prague, working under direct instructions from the Army of the Czech Republic, have declared a state of emergency in and around the city following the unexpected death of Dr. Talos Rucker. We believe that terrorists living inside the Udalek complex will use their leader's death as an excuse to rain more mayhem down on Prague, President Keisley said in a statement. Riots have been going on all day inside Gollum City, and a number of deaths have been reported. We cannot and will not let that happen here. Martial law is in effect until the crisis is lifted, with state police giving, given sweeping powers to enforce peace. Our curfew has been enacted, and no citizen, augmented or not, is allowed out on the streets. It goes without saying that any who break curfew or resist police officers will be dealt with harshly. Closure fuels root or unprecedented closure fuels rumors. The Palisade Property Bank remained closed for most of today, with its owners refusing to comment after rumors of a possible break-in <laughs> began circulating. Martial law makes it impossible to learn more at this time, although witnesses did spot VersaLife trucks leaving the bank parking garage. A dissatisfied customer, perhaps? Perhaps. Um. Oh, oh, crap, they're in this building! Oh, no. I don't want to be taking out police. Probably already read this. Yeah, we did. They're in this building. Yikes. Yikes. Exterior shields. Huh. I think that's on a, probably a vehicle outside. Oh, so they're searching. They need to give up this search, man. They need to give it up. Really wish there was a way out of here. That'd be really cool if there was some underground way to get to where I need to go, but there's not. Oh, man. This sucks. So I'm, I'm considering just running out of here and making a beeline for the train station. I don't know why the trains would be running now, but uh, that's where we need to go. Because this is one of those times... Okay, good. They are going to stop their search here in a moment. I was going to say, this is, makes me think of one of those times earlier in the game where I was being hunted and they just never completed their search. But it looks like they're going to this time, so we'll just give them a few minutes and then uh, we'll try to figure out what to do here. But man, they were... They did not waste any time, man. Um, I think we might have to go invisible here and hope that we have enough battery power to remain invisible long enough to get to the train station. So as soon as they stop their search, I'm going to do that because uh, while they're searching, if they see me in here, they'll come and get me. But if they're not searching and they see me in here, they won't do anything. So we'll give them a few more minutes here, a few more seconds to stop their search. Whoa. Okay, search complete. So now, the train station is... It's right right across from us, man. You ready? Oops, I sure do hope I have enough battery power for this. We're invisible. Oh, crap. Okay. All right. Oh no. Somebody's suspicious. 
Oh crap! Somebody's still suspicious. Oh, I do not want to mess with one of these things. I'm invisible again. <laughs> oh no, who sees me over there? Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh hell. Oh hell. Go away, dude. Go away. Oh man, how am I gonna get in here? Okay, there's a camera there. I guess that's what saw us. Need to disable these laser grids. So this doesn't make any sense to me. I mean, is is the subway even going to be running? You know? Where'd this guy go? I guess he left. So we got a camera here we need to deal with. Okay. That's... Oh gosh, I think that's a turret. Or is it? It is a turret. I should be able to completely disable it. Oh, jeez. Oh, crap. Uh. Oh, hell. Well, that's okay. I was worried that if I failed, it would blow my head off or something. Terminal locked? What's that? What's that right there? I want to disable this turret and see what the heck that is. <laughs> oh gosh, it doesn't disable permanently. What is this? Oh, it's a level four. Ah, crap. Uh, uh, let me out of here. For some reason, I thought that I could disable these things permanently. Stupid turret. Here, face the wall. So this is, uh the way I was talking about that we could have snuck in from Libby's apartments. But this was quicker and easier with using our cool AUG that makes us invisible. This kind of sucks because I still have full inventory, man. Security. Oh, level 4, man. Oh boy. Uh, we need to go... This way and this way. So we got a couple level twos here. We could fortify, but at 45% chance of detection. Okay, I think we're going to be good. Okay, we're good. Alright, turn this stupid thing off. There. So we turned off the turret. So that's cool that... that security terminal was in here now it's pretty cool so speaking of terminals what what was this over here what's this for I want to see what this is Let's see if we get into it we need to go to these two places there's two of these though what does nuke do nuke de detection 100% I'm not sure what nuke is for Program Alright, we're in. Access okay, whatever this is... Oh, you know what? This probably turned off the lasers. <laughs> I thought of that right right as I unlocked it. That's okay. That's alright. So, I mean, why would the subway even be running? You know? Eh, curfew, 10pm to 6am. So, I mean, how are we going to get to the other part of town? Well, it looks like we can do it. Um, let's do it. Let's go there. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. So he's just going to walk the tracks. Oh, this is interesting. Boy, he's no, in no hurry. Jeez. Take your time, Jensen. <laughs> just a nice little stroll on the subway tracks. <laughs> okay, dude. <laughs> Man, he, he cannot be bothered. SOS be damned. Okay, uh, we need to get from here to Jensen's apartment. And the curfew, I imagine, is taking place here as well. Um, hmm, I guess this, yeah, there's a vent up there. This doesn't take us to the sewers, does it? I guess not. So I 
feel like we might want to try to get to the sewers. There's a laser grid over there. Boy, these are all locked up again. There's a person standing over there. 3998. Okay, awesome. Okay, anything in here that I want or that's helpful? Uh, there's a vent here that might take us somewhere. I don't know. Dude standing right there, so we don't want to go that way. Let's see where this vent takes us. Huh. Interesting. So this is just really just taking us in here. I mean, we could have walked this way. Right? We could have just walked right in that door, so... Wow. All new drawers to search. Cool. New lockers? What the heck? Didn't I come in here before? Surely I came in here before. I mean, come on. I had to have, right? Maybe I didn't. I know, it's hard to remember. We've been in so many subway stations. Pocket secretary. This is from Alex Prazak to Kat Pololonik. Let me look at my notes here and see if I have anything from either of those two, those two people. Um, Alex Pran Prezak. No. Nope. Nothing about Alex and I think I would remember that other name. Cat. We've got uh, no, not her. Uh, nope. 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 Okay. So, don't know anything about these two people here. Uh, so, Alex wrote to Cat and said, can't get in. The server room. Cat. Maintenance said a burst pipe has messed up the panel providing power to the door, but they can't fix it until tomorrow. It's switched off for now because it was electrifying stuff around it. Looked scary as hell when it was on. Either way, door isn't opening until it's repaired, so you should come over yourself and make sure they're on it. For now, just give IT permission to patch me remote access. Password is Messier43. Or... Or? Why did I say or? I'd rather be out of the station anyway with all the extra police hanging around Alex. Okay, so we've learned to code to something. Okay, another uh, vent there. Ah, okay, up here. Uh, hello. Oh, okay. I guess Jensen doesn't want to be up there. Uh, uh, hello, Jensen? What's your deal, dude? Crafting parts. See, that's important. I want those. I don't know. Let's see where this vent takes us. That just takes us in here again. Another place we could have just very easily walked to. I don't know, I guess we would have had to hack that keypad, so I guess maybe it saved us a little bit of trouble. Um, security unlocked. Cameras. This one's turned off. This looks like it's in a... a, a I guess it's... Where is this? In the train station? Turn that off. And alarms. Trigger alarm. Disable alarm panels. There. Now you can't hit an alarm even if you want to. I'll take that credit chip. Thank you very much. Ah. Breach software. Stem processor chip I can't pick up. Stealth software. Well, I was kind of hoping that uh, there would be a way to the sewers from here, but it doesn't look like there is, huh? So we need to get out of here. Now this is bad. Because the only way out is past this guy over here, it's looking like, right? I don't think I remember there being any way from here to the outside world. Pretty sure there's not. Ah, huh, green guy down there. Who's he? Who's this down here? 
I'm, I can't tell. There's somebody over here that might be Caller. This might be the time machine over here, right? I can't tell. Huh, interesting though, right? I don't know. I don't think that's Kohler. It's kind of interesting though, right? Huh. Whoops. Some on the ground over here. Credit chip, thank you. <laughs> I have so many credits. Fill this hole with probably clanks is what that said. See, here's a vent here, but I'm pretty sure that this one just takes us back to the, uh, yeah, this part here, so. Oh, man. How am I going to get past these guys? I guess we could take them out. Whoa, computer. Oh, crap. Oh, he's looking this direction. Get these stupid, stupid, stupid lasers here. I don't see this guy. Oh, there he is right there. Okay. Well, he's looking this way all right. You need to stop looking this way, dude. I'm trying to line it up so I could take out these uh, grids. Here we go. Okay, grids disabled. Oh, he made him suspicious. Interesting. Yep, time to take out a cop. You're coming with me. Let's put him right here. Okay. Yeah, he was easy enough to take out. Let's see what's going on up here. <laughs> 